Today, I am so happy to be announcing a brand new version of Photolu that we've been working on for about six months. It's our brand new AI smart uploader for photographers. Now, about four years ago, we released the first beta version of Photolu that uploaded one photo to three different sites. And over the past four years, we've added a ton of new features and 10 new sites. And photographers have now used Photolu to upload photos to websites over 125,000 times. Now this is really amazing and we are so grateful to all of you who have integrated Photolu into your workflows. But like around mid last year, we started to look at how Photolu and the industry had changed over the past four years. And we realized that if we wanted to stay relevant into 2021 and beyond, we really needed to rethink and redesign the way that Photolu worked. Things have changed. These days, everybody has a phone with a good camera on it and everybody is posting those photos online. It isn't enough anymore just to post your photos to Instagram with a bunch of good hashtags. These days, for photographers to be successful, they need to have a strong online presence. And that means uploading quality photos to multiple sites regularly. And unfortunately, the return on investment for putting your photos online is less than ever. It keeps getting harder and harder to even get your followers to see your posts on Facebook and Instagram without paying to promote them. On top of that, the stock sites are slashing their prices as the market gets more and more saturated. And to add to that, COVID-19 has changed everything and many photographers have seen a drastic decrease in revenue. So it's more important than ever to have a strong online presence if you want to get your photos in front of potential clients. However, the ROI of your time to build that online presence is lower than ever. Now, one of the things we realized was that the ROI and the investment needed to get noticed these days is so much higher just because of the supply. There's a massive amount of photos being uploaded to the internet every day. And as of Photolu, we can't change that. But what we can do is drastically decrease the amount of time the photographers need to take to build their online presence. So that's where we focused. With that in mind, we completely redesigned, reinvented, and rebuilt Photolu from the ground up to get your photos everywhere easier than ever. And that's what I'm gonna to demo to you today. The first thing you're gonna notice is the new modern look and feel. But the changes that we made are not just cosmetic. Everything from loading to logging in to uploading photos has been rebuilt to be faster. We really wanted to make getting your photos online quick and easy. And I think you'll be amazed at how fast and easy this new version is. Now, when you log in, you'll be taken directly to the upload page. Now you can drag and drop your photos into the upload box or click to select them from your hard drive. This is where you will see the biggest change. And this is our number one requested feature in Fortaloo. You can now select multiple photos for upload. So I just grabbed seven photos from some trips I took with my family over the summer, but you can do the same thing with up to 25 photos at a time. I've already tweaked these photos in Lightroom and I exported them as JPEGs. Now, one thing to note is that I've already set up Photolu to link to all my sites. You can see those sites here. We do have another video on how to link sites and I'll link to that in the description of this video. Next, I'll walk you through the three most common ways that we see people using Photolu to build their online presence. One is uploading their photos to multiple sites at the same time. Also, Photolu can schedule your photos to upload to your social sites. And lastly, a lot of people use Photolu to upload a lot of photos to stock sites quickly. Now, one huge difference between Photolu and other apps that upload your photos to social sites is that at Photolu, we understand photographers' workflow. And we understand that a lot of photographers like to use metadata to store information about your images, things like titles, captions, and keywords that are entered into Lightroom. So when you upload a photo to Photolu, it's gonna read that data and allow you to use it in your posts when you're uploading your photos to different sites. Now, first is the stock section. I did already put a title and description in for this photo in Lightroom, and here I can choose to use the caption, which is the default, the title, an AI generated description, or both the title and the description. Next is Smug Mug and Flickr. These default to the photo title and description I enter in Lightroom, which looks good, so I'll move on. Now we're at the keywords. Now I entered the location I took this photos as keywords in Lightroom, so they're gonna show up here. But most sites allow up to 50 keywords. The Photolu keywording AI suggests keywords below, and I can choose individually or just click a button and it will take the best keywords to make 50, fast and easy. To be honest, it isn't worth the time to meticulously keyword every photo anymore. So our AI does the job for you. Next is Instagram. Now it is using the caption for the post, which looks good, but I also need to add hashtags. The Photolu Instagram hashtagging AI will suggest hashtags with different popularities to choose from. 
I'm going to choose my favorite hashtags, then grab a couple of the very popular hashtags and fill the rest with the most popular. Next is Twitter. We can use the caption here as well. Now in this section, we can schedule it for later, but right now I just want to post my photo to my 13 link site so I can click complete photo. And now it gets uploaded to all 13 sites. See how easy that was by using the AI powered smart uploader. Now that was just one photo, the old version of photo that could do that. But where this new version really signs is doing multiple photos. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take three photos and post them to all my social sites. You know, if you want to have a strong online presence these days, you need to be posting photos regularly, preferably daily. But who has the time to upload photos every single day? That's where Photoloo can come in and help. So I'm going to schedule these for the next three days. So I already entered the title and description for these in Lightroom. And those are the ones I want to use for my social sites. But for stock, I want a different title and description which describes the scene. So I'm going to select all of them and start off with the AI generated description. Now I can click through each of them to see what was generated and tweak as needed. For Smug Mug and Flickr, I'm going to keep what I had in Lightroom. Now for keywords, I forgot to add the province, so I'll add them all here at once. I can mass update the photo keywords easily. Next, I'll check the AI keywords for each one to add them. Yep, those look good. Now for this time, I'm just going to use the defaults for Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. But this time, I don't want to post all these sites right now. A key to having a strong online presence is to constantly upload new photos online. But you don't have time to do that every day, so you can schedule them to upload automatically. For this one, I'll upload tomorrow, and the next day, and the day after that. Then, when I click complete, my photos are scheduled for the next three days. Now that feels pretty good, realizing that I've got my photos set on autopilot to upload for the rest of the week. All right, the next thing I want to show you is how to get your photos on stock sites quickly. With the stock site slashing prices, you know, it's not worth the time to spend a lot of time uploading your photos to stock, but it is a great passive income for photographers. So you don't want to abandon it completely, but you do need to make sure you have a very streamlined workflow if you want to make it worthwhile. So I'm going to select them all and then uncheck the sites I don't want to post to, and then I'll grab the AI title for each photo in the stock section. One thing to note here is that Photoloo does save all your work in the upload section. So this star here shows that there's unsaved changes. And if I wanted to save it and step away from my computer, just click the save button and this will be here when I come back. Now over in this photo, it has a logo. So I know that some of the sites are going to reject this if I don't post it as editorial. But not all stock sites allow editorial. So I can use this checkbox to deselect the stock sites that, that don't allow editorial photos. And I'm going to use the format that Sh Shutterstock requires for the description. Just use that for all the sites. Now I'll just check my keywords on each one before selecting all and uploading to all the sites. And that's it. So now those three photos are going to be uploaded to eight different microstock sites. So that's 24 uploads running. Now you can leave Photoloo right now and get on with your day or go into the completed photos page and see the status. So this is also completely new, built from the ground up. So I can see here these are still uploading, but I can see the first photo I uploaded here already done. I can click the items here to see the post and respond to any comments if needed. If you want to see what data was used to upload the photo, just flip over the card and you can see. Now I know a lot of you like to keep the AI generated keywords in your photo organization tool like Lightroom. So we made it easy to copy them. Just click the keywords and now they're in your clipboard to be pasted wherever you want. Another great thing about Photoloo is that you can easily see which sites your photos have been uploaded to. So let's say in the future I didn't have a good photo of one day, so let's say for Flickr. I could just easily post this photo to Flickr because it hasn't been posted there yet. Now this is great because we're constantly modeling the best sites to upload your photos to. So if another site gets popular, we'll add it to Photoloo. And you can easily go into Photoloo and just upload all your previous photos to that new site. No problem. Now see how fast and easy that was? You know, I think most photographers understand that it is important to upload your photos online to build that online presence. But the problem is it's just tedious. It's tedious work that we don't want to do. And that's what we built Photoloo for, to get rid of the tedious tasks so that you can focus on your photography. I hope you like it. So we have two versions of Photoloo. We have a free version that lets you upload five photos every week for free, no credit card required. So if you're just getting started building your online presence, you can do it for free with Photoloo. 
Now, if you need more than five uploads a week, we have paid subscriptions that you can purchase. But when you get a subscription, you get the first 14 days free. So you can try it out and see if it fits into your workflow before paying anything. If you want to find out more information, check out www.photoloo.com or I'll put a link up here to our website where you can learn more. Best of luck selling your photos online.